All right, what's good, YouTube? So today I have, that's right, I got some Fairfield repackaged products featuring Hidden Fates. I saw this at Target, and I was super intrigued by it. So they only had two, and of course, this other one with the Charizard pack has good old Steam Siege in it. And uh, so I'm going to open these up, see if I can pull anything out of the Hidden Fates packs. And because it's only four packs, after I'm done opening this stuff up, I got five more packs to open up. Uh, just, you know, because opening four booster packs is uh, would be like a two-minute video. So, all right, let's go ahead and get this. Uh, so there are two packs and 40 sleeve pack repackage deals here. You get some nice uh, blue sleeves. We got that. Let me get this other one out. But yeah, so they're starting to put Hidden Fates in uh, in these. So uh, I'm curious, what do you guys think? Do you think they like weigh them? I've heard a lot of people say they think uh, Fairfield weighs their packs. And, you know, I wouldn't be too surprised if that's the case. And uh, yeah, so let's see what's in this Steam Siege real quick. Three to the front. But yeah, I'm I'm wondering if uh, if I'll be able to pull out a shiny rufflet. Is that a hollow? Yeah, it is. Hollow Ampharos. Um, I'm wondering if I'll be able to pull out a shiny Pokemon card. Make sure it's uh, it's legit. It's, it feels legit. There is the Hidden Fates code. And four to the front. All right, let's see what you got for me, Fairfield. The infamous, mo one of the most hated companies in the Pokemon community, probably. Ugh. Yeah. Thanks for nothing. No, I'm playing. All right. We got this other one, and at least this one has a team-up pack. That's a lot better than Steam Siege. For sure. All right. I have like 80 sleeves after uh, after this little opening, so that's, that's useful. Alright, get this, get these sleeves, got the bulk, get that out of the way. Alright, let's open up this team up. Pull a Jirachi. Or the, uh, the non-holo or reverse holo Charizard, that'd be cool. I've been pulling a lot of those at a team up. As of recently, we got a Weedle. Ooh, Black Market and a Beedrill. Not too bad. I'll take a Prism. That's cool. I'll sleeve that up. Even though Prism Stars aren't that valuable, I think they're really cool. Alright, get the bulk out of the way. And then let's, let's get into this Hidden Fates. We're only opening up two Hidden Fates from, from this uh, repackaged third-party... Fairfield, so it's not really a good test to see, like, can you pull anything good? Because it's such a small sample size, but we will find out anyway. Oof. Okay. Hollow Jesse and James. Don't really care about that. I have a hundred of those, but a nice shiny Quagsire. So we did manage to pull a shiny card from, from this. So that is pretty awesome. And then let's get this off to the side and let's get into these other packs. I got some Shining Legends. We got more chances at pulling shiny Pokemon cards. So let's start off with this. Ooh, we got a white code from Evolutions. Evolutions has been treating me so well recently. I've been pulling Charizards left and right. And I already see something shiny, so the the excellent treatment continues. <laughs> Holy crap, yo. <laughs> Literally, I am so lucky. I am so freaking lucky, dude. So, I think out of the last three packs of evolutions that I have opened up, I have gotten... Two of these in a the the hollow from the set. Wow, I need I need to go buy some evolutions. Ew, this is a burning shadow, so we will not be pulling anything out of this. But there's a free code at least, and a 
whole lot of nothing. But yo, I need to I need to buy some some more evolutions, obviously, because it's just been giving me Charizards left and right. Cosmic Eclipse code once again. The green codes have been spoiling. The surprise tag call that used to be good, but all right, let's do sword and shield. I'll save shining legends for last. That pack's a little harder to find. So there is the sword and shield code, and let's do four to the front. Okay, sword and shield. Kind of getting burnt out on this set, but you know, I'm gonna still try. I'm gonna still try to. To pull stuff. Pokemon Catcher and a Lapras. That seems about right. Alright guys, last pack. Shining Legends. Um, this opening was definitely a success. We pulled a Mega Charizard. There's a Shining Legends code. So, even if uh, we don't pull anything here, let's say win, win. Here we go. Croconaw, Litten, Larvesta, Breloom. Ooh, a nice reverse hollow grass energy and a Yveltal. This is a hit, though, in my opinion. So, um, yeah, we opened up, like, nine booster packs. Pulled a Mega Charizard EX. I've been pulling these left and right. Wow. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So, yeah, I hope you guys like the little opening. Um, and, yeah, so... Tune in tomorrow. I hope I'm able to do it. Um, I'm trying to upload the Q&A video answering all the questions you guys asked me. So um, thank you guys so much. And I will catch you in tomorrow's video, hopefully with the Q&A. <laughs> all right. Peace.